G'day guys, welcome back to another episode. The day is here, set up time at the Perth Boat Show. It's going crazy. Setting up the tables, setting up the merch, we've got the ski. West Oz Prospector, he's all set up, living the dream, they're ready to go. Fishing, wishing life, a couple of last minute things. Day one at the Perth Convention and Exhibition Centre. We are at the Boat Show 2022. We are so excited. We can't wait. It's our first time. Come and join us. Follow us in. Here we are, guys. This is our setup. Got a few bits and pieces, got some mats, got all our merch as well, so I'm sure heaps of people are coming through next couple of days to grab some merch. Got the new hoodies as well. Jump online, um, when this video comes out, these will be available. Huntersanddrifters.co. Got our Spiro shirts as well. Got the ski, got a Jew bag. Obviously our sponsor Jew bag always looking after us, so thanks for that. Someone will win that over the next couple of days. Got a couple of cray loops here from Old Man Blue, best in the business, best cray loops going. And obviously got my new Aquagat as well on show for people to check out. Heaps of mats for sale, so yeah, we're super excited. We got Lucy, she's here as well. Woo. Ready for a live stream, got all the gear on. The hell yeah. How exciting. Yeah. Your setup looks amazing. Got the new rods in as well. They're gonna be pretty, pretty hot on the press, I reckon. <laughs> so let's get excited, day one. We can't wait. Let's see who we meet. Let's go! Alright guys, so the boat show's just started. We're just gonna get around and have a quick look at a few a few boats and stuff before we uh, get settled in. That's a, one of the new Hain signatures, that looks so cool. Amazing work, blue colour. These, um, these look awesome. So many cool boats here. Have a look at this thing, here it is. This is the new Fury S660 Spiro boat. Epic. I had twin 425s. Oh, look at this. One of Nyad's prestige boats. One of the best ones I've built, I would think. Twin Ray Marines, got the joystick control. This thing's unreal. Room up there to sleep, I'm not sure if you can see that. And then, yeah, just going all the way down the back, we've got the big twin 425s. How cool is that? How crazy is this thing? Rally Center console. And Barbara Gallo Marine. Amazing. Run a couple of twin 250s. Good luck catching them, man. Alright, here it is, guys. The boat show has officially started. Doors just opened. Alright, guys, day one. So heading up on stage for our first um, interview with Carl Langdon. He's going to ask us a bunch of questions, just about a few bits and bobs. Got some giveaways as well from Jubite, so thanks so much for that. And also giving away one of the old man blue cray measures here, so pretty happy with that. A bit of Jubite stuff. Cam, thanks for that. Legend. So yeah, heading up on stage now, so pretty exciting stuff. Let's go. Introduce yourself and uh, just tell us a bit about uh, how it all began. Yeah, um, hey, how you going everyone? Uh, Caden here from Hunters and Drifters. Um, look, for us, I suppose Hunters and Drifters started, um, we lived up north, so we moved away from our family. Me and my partner Britta, um, seven years ago, we moved up just past um, Exmouth into Onslow. And a lot of our family were saying, you know, do you get out March? Do you explore? Do you check out the area? And, you know, could you send us some photos? So, Sending a couple of photos turned into making a few videos and here we are, um, hunters and drifters, um, you know, selling merch, creating heaps of YouTube videos and um, getting out and exploring um, WA and fishing and diving around the coast and yeah, around the metro waters, um, up north, wherever we can really. 
Now you are a spear fisher and I firmly told you that I'm not for the main reasons of those things that wear grey suits. Uh, have you had some experience around this sort of scenario? If so, can you bring us in to say what it's been like in your experience? Yeah, for sure. Obviously, yeah, we, I mainly spearfish and me and my partner mainly spearfish, but yeah, the men in grey suits, um, they're pretty crazy. So yeah, I've had a lot of different experiences. Um, most recently, my last dive before I moved to Perth, I, I dropped down, it was probably about 17 metres, dropped down, I shot a beautiful coral trout, started bringing it back up and out of nowhere, this monster bull shark just came and took the whole fish, the spear, and must have, yeah, the spear must have lodged into its mouth and um, unfortunately, yeah, took my whole gun as well. So. That was a bit of a, a bit of a um, wild one, but yeah, I do see a lot of sharks and stuff like that. Most of them pretty friendly, but yeah, you do come across those odd ones that um, aren't so friendly and yeah, want to ruin your day. All right, and you've got a couple of goodies to give away today, have you? Is that uh, what you've got in your hand there? So we got a couple of questions from the floor. Is that what we're doing? <laughs> um, oh yeah, questions. Obviously, yeah, one of our main sponsors is Dubai Tackle. Um, they're over there if you want to grab something. And Old Man Blue, they support us a lot as well. We're also running two giveaways at our store, so if you purchase anything from us, um, you're going the chance to win a Jew bag, which is one of our big sponsors. Um, and if you um, if you just come over, subscribe and follow us um, on YouTube and Instagram, you're going the chance to win an Old Man Blue Cray Loop and some Jew Bite Tackle. So yeah, money for jam there, but um, I'll put it to the floor. Anyone um, want to put their hand up and say what their favorite fish is to catch and eat? At the front, Jewies. Yeah, perfect, this will be good for you then. <laughs> I'll give you that little skirt, mate. Thanks very much. Yeah, no worries. Thank you. Yeah, Dewey's, anyone else got a nice um, fish that they like to target? And what's their technique they like to target it? Taylor. Taylor? Yeah. Yeah, cool. <laughs> yeah, Taylor around the metro area. It's something I haven't really done yet, but definitely keen to um, yeah, broaden the horizons and check that out for sure. Um, what about squid? Are you getting squid? Uh, maybe sun protection? <laughs> yeah, sun protection, perfect, there you go. Do you buy a hat for you? How good's that? Um, anyone like squinting? Anyone? Yeah, Jeep from Dubai there. And obviously got one of these skirts as well. Anyone want a skirt? Yeah, no worries, mate. Thank you. There you go, buddy. Thank you. Any divers among us or crayfishermen? Thank you. Yeah, perfect, there you go. Got an old man blue um, little gauge here for you. Pretty sweet. Yeah, so I've got the crayfish measurement there. If you spear as well, this is like a, um, you can hook it on your fin and then so you can pull your fish out. It's pretty cool. And a bottle opener as well. Yeah, no worries, man. Anytime. There you go. Couple of little giveaways for the crowd. Hope you guys um, get out there and explore and get to use some of that gear. There we go. First day, first bit of stage talk done. So pretty happy with that. It's all good fun. Giving out a few goodies. Speaking to a few members of the crowd, Carl, so it's all good fun, but back at the stand now, so let's see who comes past. We've got Will and James coming to check out the store today. How are you going, guys? You guys enjoying the boat show? Yeah, no, it's really awesome. good. Yeah, really good? Really yeah. What's your favourite boat you've seen so far? Uh, probably the alley boats. Already. Yeah. yeah. A yeah. couple of alley boys yeah. enjoying the big alley boats at the boat show. Yeah. Thanks for coming past, lads. No Cheers, no thank you. Have a good one. A couple more customers down at the boat show. Introduce yourselves, guys. Hi. <laughs> What do you reckon? Better than going to school? Yes. Yeah. Checking out the boat show. Wish my parents took me to the boat show instead of going to school. Lucky for some, hey? guys that's it the end of day one unreal we've had such a good day haven't we guys yeah good epic, day today epic little day epic little day how good that was oh got the new jet pilot on there oh, that's nice yeah. that's nice <laughs> what a day what a day not bad good. can't complain day one done and dusted we'll see you guys day two bright and early let's go well guys early morning started day two just got a coffee Heading to the convention center now. Day two, let's get started. 
that I needed this this morning. Today was such a massive day, so many things to do. I'm gonna try to get around to the boat show a little bit more today. It's gonna to be really busy, but have a look at some more of the boats and should have show you guys some of the companies that have got things on uh, display and check out what their newest sort of vessels are and we'll get a good look at them. So, let's go, day two, woo! All right guys, well we're here, inside. We've just had our coffees, feeling nice and fresh, and we're just gonna have a little wander around. Let's come across these Westerbergs. These look um, amazing, build quality on these, look so good. I'm going to see for a 150. Heaps of deck space for a smaller boat. I got this massive big Wildcat 7200 as well. That thing looks like an absolute weapon. Serious solid trailer as well. One of two big Mercury's. Twin 200s. Awesome access as well. Beautiful gripping on the deck. That's the arm. Um, yeah. Westerberg cat. What a weapon. Alright guys, this one here is the Venom Striker. This one looks amazing. 24 foot. Serious attention to detail and everything they've done on this boat. Had a real good look over this one yesterday in my spare time. Run the massive big Verado. 300. White. That's nice. And yeah, this is it here. Uh, outriggers. All hand laid as well. Ace trailer. the inside. This is the other Venom Striker that they built. Like I said, this is my favourite boat of the show. Locally WA built. Attention to detail is just, yeah, second to none. Enclosed hard cab. Um, the other one that I showed you earlier had the sliding windows, which is pretty cool. you got vents up in the roof there, you can see. Massive solid bow rail. Sort of on a 233 design. The hull, um, super thick, and um, yeah, that's it there. Trailer again, really, really nice. This one's all decked out with Simrad gear. Yeah, it's my pick of the show, this one. All right, guys, this is an Axa Pass. A bit, a bit of a different sort of um, hull shape, this one. Fully stepped hull, I don't know if you guys can see that in the clip. Sorry about the lighting as well, I know it'll be flashing, but um, yeah, there's nothing you can do in the convention center. Two massive big donks on the back. Um, twin 300s, but yeah, sort of like an expedition type vessel these ones, and um, yeah, really like enclosed cab, sliding doors on the side, um, massive boat, I don't exactly know the length of this one, but yeah, this one's called the Cross Cabin, um, full of breaking windows, just yeah, real expedition type vessel, um, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool, different different sort of take on a boat, but yeah, it's wicked, something um, different, it's got that full pull out awning up the front there, um, get over a rotto in any sort of conditions in this truck, so yeah, I'm liking this. All right, guys, we are in. We are in. Day two is about to start. Doors are about to open. Everything's set up. Got the boys living the dream. They're all ready to go. Get there, we get there. Prospector, he's all set up. There's us. We're all ready to go. There, you're getting some content. It's Brucey. She's all ready to go. Fishing Mission Life, they're all ready to go. West Coast Boat Works doing the last final touches on the ski. Things come up a treat, have a look at it. Shiny as anything. But we're here, ready to go. Day two, get excited. Let's, let's see what today brings. All right guys, the boat show's in full swing now. Day two, everyone's rocking up. It's crazy, we've got people everywhere. There it is. What content creator corner? Brookie Jew Hunter, Paulie, everyone's here. He's the ass, so I think it's this. We got one of our long time standing members of Hunters and Drifters, yeah. Xavier Cox. He's joining us at the store. So he's come down to hang out with us for the day, so. So good, so many people, like I said. Heaps of people rolling through. SP Lucy, she's probably live on stream again. Yeah. Living it up. So, we've got an interview going on here with the uh, team. Kind of wreckfish west, so, yeah, it's just all about the band and everything like that. So, it's all happening down here. There we go, it's all happening. Go and have a look at the stand. 
it's been good. There are heaps of new people, it's been so fun. Having a really, really good time down here. Crazy boats, crazy people. So cool to meet heaps of people and get around. How you been going there, Yeah, good mate, good yourself. Yeah, if you guys haven't um, seen already, check out West Dolls Prospector. Uh, heaps of diving, cool videos, making really fun stuff. Finding things out in the ocean, out in the bush. It's all, um, it's all good fun, mate. Sure is, mate. Sure is. Get you out one day? Absolutely. Out on the fish bro. Keen as, get out in the fish bro. <laughs> Go have a look around, stay tuned. Welcome <laughs> by. Checking out the, uh, Checking out the setup. Thanks, boys, for coming past. Have yeah, a good day. Yeah. Get after no it. See you, boys. G'day guys, welcome back. Day three. It's crazy this morning. People everywhere. Bruce is on, she's on the live feed. She's um, streaming live, so probably see me very shortly. Hey! <laughs> so yeah, it's all happening. Crazy, crazy crowd. Thanks so much to everyone that has come down over the past couple of days. It's so cool to meet you all, grabbing merch, supporting us, what we do. Um, it's what we love and what we you know, want to do full time. So we love, we love meeting you all, we love your support. We can't thank you enough. So from me and Britta, thanks heaps. Woo. Day three, let's go. Got the Wheatley SL22 hardtop, sliding windows, new merch. Whitley stand looks pretty nice. Not a lot of people have a lot of interest in the Whitley's. So I've got a massive following in WA, so serious bit of kit. And the Garmin 22 foot. Yeah, nice boat. Albacore CC 640. Pretty sweet. 6.4 meters with a 200. Such a nice setup on this center console. They're really liking it. Clean, tidy, really nice upholstery and trimming, so that's a bit of a ripper. How crazy is this one, mate? Nia, 10 meter. Twin 425 horsepowers. You guys might see a few episodes in this later on down the track. I kept that a bit of a secret, but yeah, this is a crazy boat. I can't, yeah. Go to Roto any conditions. Um, yeah, wow. We had a look inside this one yesterday, and the finish inside this is crazy. Second to none, so it's pretty awesome. Rob from Kirby Marine's done an amazing job on this one, so. And there's a, some cool features on board as well, so. Crazy uh, seats. I've got the almonds. All right, guys, day three, crazy. Got a couple of lads checking out the store. How are we going, boys? Introduce yourselves. Awesome, I'm Tom. I'm Ben. Yeah, Tommy and Ben. How's the show been? You been enjoying it? Awesome. Sick boats around. Yeah, sick Pirelli over there. Go check that out. Yeah, that thing's a weapon, man. So check out Hunters and Drifters on YouTube. Yeah, check us out. Check us out. That Pirelli's crazy. He's got twin 600s. Unreal. So, crazy day. Cheers, boys. Thanks for coming by. Cheers. Couple of boys down at the stand. Coming in. Yeah. Thanks for coming in, boys. No worries, brother. Any day. Well, there it is, guys. That is the end of the boat show. Day three. Done and dusted. We're packing everything up. What a crazy week. Pack up mode on. Pack up mode's engaged. We got all the boys. Engaged. Engaged. We're so stoked. Thanks everyone again um, for coming to visit, coming to buy stuff from us, supporting us. It's, you know, it's what we love and yeah, we couldn't be more grateful. So 
thanks again sorry if any of the footage wasn't great obviously the lights here sometimes can ruin the gopro footage but hopefully it's good so hope you enjoyed it hope you enjoyed the boat show hope you enjoyed the tour and um stay tuned for the next episode we'll see you guys out there Woo!